We're asked to write the second order system of differential equations, y1 double prime plus y1 plus y2 equals t, and y2 double prime plus y1 minus y2 equals t squared as a first order system. We do this by introducing new variables. Let's begin by letting u1 equal y1. Notice the highest derivative of y1 in the first differential equation is the second derivative, and therefore we will stop assigning new variables for y1 at the first derivative, one derivative less than the highest derivative in the differential equation. So we'll let u2 equal y1 prime. Now we move to y2. We will now let u3 equal y2, and again, looking at the second differential equation, notice how the highest derivative of y2 is the second derivative, and therefore we stop assigning new variables for y2 at the first derivative, again, one less derivative than the highest derivative in the differential equation. So we have u4 equals y2 prime. And now before we get to the differential equations, we need to express equations that relate u1 through u4. If u1 is equal to y1 and u2 is equal to y1 prime, then u1 prime is equal to u2. And if u3 is equal to y2 and u4 is equal to y2 prime, then u3 prime is equal to u4. And now let's move to the first differential equation. We have y1 double prime plus y1 plus y2 equals t. If u2 is equal to y1 prime, then u1 double prime is equal to u2 prime. This gives us u2 prime, and then plus y1 plus y2 is u1 plus u3, which equals t. Notice this is a first order differential equation. And then for the second differential equation, if u4 is equal to y2 prime, then y2 double prime is equal to u4 prime. And then we have plus y1 minus y2, which is u1 minus u3, which is equal to t squared. We now have the first order system. We now have the given second order system of differential equations as a first order system. I hope you found this helpful.